on. Hi guys. So last night I got a tip from my friend Rachel from work that some of the Lego Harry Potter sets that were supposed to be released on Monday got accidentally released at the local Walmart. So, it's a leaky Walmart. Yes. So we're <laughs> like the leaky cauldron. Yeah. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> so we're going to go check and see if they have any left. So let's go. Here we go. All right. We're in the Lego aisle. Let's see what we got. All right. I see. <gasps> They do have it. Here it is. Oh my gosh, expect a Matrona. It's here. I didn't think it was because they tucked it back a little bit. Oh, look at this. This Fancy. is like the highlight of the set. I'm oh so dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Found it. We found it. <laughs> Let's see, you got anything else? That's the old one. Yeah, Fantastic Beats. And the old Spidery. Yeah, and then they have the Newts. The Newt. And then they have the Whomping Willow. Still have that. That's it. All right, well, let's grab one. Yeah, we're grabbing it. It's coming with us. Come we with got me. it. <laughs> Look what you got. We got it. And we're back and we have the set in the vlog room and we're ready to build. Two days early, right? Two days? Two days, yeah. But my friend's tip, she texted me late last night and said that she was at Walmart and she saw it. So technically, three days. Yeah. Could have early. been there for months. Who goes Who to Walmart? knows? <laughs> But we, just for fun, we also checked our local Target and Barnes and Noble because those seem to be the places where these Lego sets could be. And nope, they had all the old sets there. None of the new, none of the new sets. So this was a Walmart thing. And we just think it was a happy accident. So that's the only thing we can think of for why it was there. Yay! <laughs> you get to benefit from that. <laughs> all right, so this set is uh, called Expecto Patronum. It has 121 pieces, which is... Like, Expecto Patronum is Latin for a small set, I think. Yes. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, it only has 121 pieces, which uh, so far with the boxed sets, this is the smallest one out of them all. And at $20, I think that what you're really paying for is this, uh... You get five or four figures and a deer. I mean, that's... I know, that's true. Figures are about four bucks each. Yeah, so so I think it's worth the price. Yeah. That uh, Patronus is, is pretty cool looking. But let's see it in person. Let's uh, open up this set and let's build this thing. Opening it up. The seal has been broken. It's mostly assembled. <laughs> well, instructions. All right, that's it. That's the box. I mean, this is a small set. We're experimenting. We're figuring it out as we go along. In the comment section down below, tell us whether you like the front view camera or the back view camera better. This is not what I expected. It has like sort of rubbery antlers. Like, feel that. That's Fancy. interesting. <laughs> Sirius doesn't even get a wand because he's the prisoner of Azkaban. It's the ghost of Pac-Man from Azkaban. <laughs> no! Kylo Ren. <laughs> so those are pretty cool. All right, should we do, you do this page and I'll do this page?
magic. Oh, interesting. They tricked us. Oh, I thought we were working on a single branch. It's a tree, not a branch. <laughs> tree. Wow. They are tricky. That's a secret here, is the dental floss. Prop I just just through the roof because we have to glide. I know. Glide <laughs> Shield, which goes into the cannon. Does that shoot? Yes. Wow. That's why it has that little caution bombardment symbol, like from Simpsons. Bombardment, bombardment. We did it! Oh, yay! <laughs> we saved the Dementors from the serious blast. <laughs> I think you got those confused. The Dementors have a dark backstory, I bet. Yeah, they they're, do. They're they're oppressed, I think. <laughs> they don't want to do their job. They're forced. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, they don't like. They want to be nice. Like, I mean, they they are trying to give people kisses. See, they just want peace, love, and understanding. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, we're already done with this very quick set. But I have to say, I do like sort of how the trees are like this forced perspective more so than what you would expect a traditional tree to be shaped like. However, if, from the back, it just doesn't look as nice, I guess. Like you definitely can't view it from all angles. You have to like, this is how the set needs and to look. And that seems to be the trend with Harry Potter stuff. Like they're half a building, like the back side is missing or, you know, it's, it's a one-sided play. <laughs> oh, a one-sided play. Oh, I like that. <laughs> but yeah, I would say that the minifigures are definitely the shining part of this. Um, you're getting this. You're Literally. Getting... Ooh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, the Patronus is definitely what you're spending your money on is to get this special piece that's only uh, available in this set. And also um, that you have Harry and Sirius in his prison outfit, and a couple more Dementors to add to your collection and to really create a Dementor swarm with this set. So yeah, I, I really like it. I thought I think it was worth the money, worth the time, and I, once again, I, I don't think I'm, I'm gonna be upset with any of these sets. Well, that, really. one, that one set, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> we are planning on July 1st to go to the Lego store and pick up the remaining Harry Potter sets. So be looking for a video very, very soon of that. And of course, we're gonna build them all on this channel. I'm the Musical Nurse, this is my husband William, and we'll see you guys real soon. Bye! Don't worry, he will. He will come.